bad wolf here, and as you are probably very well aware, Monday, Wizards announce um, a new ban and restricted list and updated that. Um, one, it was a week early, so we were all suspicious that morning till they announced it. And two, they have banned some standard cards that really, really needed to be banned, although one of them I wasn't quite expecting that one. But I thought we'd talk about it a little bit, because um, I want to know what your opinions are. And also, I'm not very good at the whole modern side, so I am I hear that those two cards being banned were a good thing. But I want to hear your opinions below as well. So, in standard, Emrakul the Promised End is banned, Smuggler's Copter is banned, and Reflector Mage is banned. In modern... Gitaxian Probe and Golgari Grave Troll have been banned. Nothing else has been updated. Um, that's, you know, they always say that. Um, so those are the five cards that are now banned. In addition to everything else that's banned, of course. So, like I said, I'm not going to talk a lot about the two modern cards because I don't know a lot of those. I'm still working on it. Dredge has been get a big rise lately because of the Cathartic Reunion, so I'm not surprised that something from Dredge was banned at all. But... Uh, uh, that, that's about all I know about those two cards. So standard, this is where I'm a little bit stronger at. Emrakul, um, yeah, I'm okay with this being banned. Um, getting it out on turn four or five, having to play against it is awful. When I, when I play magic, I want to play magic. I don't want to show up and have my opponent play my deck for me. And it, I don't know, I guess it just, for me, it just doesn't feel good when that happens, especially like in a, in a in a tournament setting. Like you know, I don't know. It just, I I don't know. I just feel bad. It was, oh, there's there's some card that that does that that I've played before, and it's just, it just makes me really upset because it's like, well, I can't do anything now, and it, and it really frustrates me. So I'm pretty happy that's banned. Um, yeah, that's why I, I haven't really gotten into standard, because it's either play Emrakul or don't. I really don't want to play against her, so, yeah, so, yeah. Okay, Smuggler's Copter. Um, ever since the first, like, one of the first, um, GPs, or I can't even, it might have even been the Pro Tour, that it was on, um, there were, uh, what's four times eight? Thirty-two? Thirty-two copies in the top eight. That means every top eight deck had a complete playset. So no matter what color you were running, you were running four Smuggler's Copter. Um, so I can understand why this one is bad. I totally forgot it existed because I'd been so worked up over Emrakul that um, I was like, oh yeah, this this card. Yes, I forgot. that That's there. And it's just really good. I was explaining it to Mr. Bad Wolf, and he was, and I was like, oh, it's a two mana, you crew it for one, and it's like a three three, and it has flying. He's like, well, that's really good. I'm like, wait, 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 there's more. He's like, no, there can't be. That would be way too broken. I'm like, yeah, it, it's broken. That yeah, the the loot thing is really what throws it over the edge. And to be honest, I think that's gonna hurt a lot of vehicle decks right now because that looting was. Looting is just awesome, I've come to learn. Maybe it has to do with the drawing cards thing and being able to get what you need, but looting is amazing. So it, losing Smuggler's Copter is going to hurt a lot, and I'm really sad because I actually opened one and I didn't sell it yet. So I've got a Smuggler's Copter just in case. It becomes unbanned. We'll, we'll hold it for then. The third standard card that got banned was Reflector Mage. What? What? Why didn't this get banned during the Coco Apocalypse? I'm just saying, maybe Wizards is taking a new approach to bannings and being more proactive about it, but I feel Mr. Reflector Mage has kind of dropped off the, the, the window. The window? The scene? I don't know. It's just dropped off and became, I didn't even remember that it existed. I had to go back and figure out which one it was, and then I got it wrong. That was embarrassing. But, um, yeah. I mean, I guess if you do get rid of Emrakul, Blue-Eyed Flash comes back, and so you've got to nerf that. But they play, they run Gideon. Can we get rid of Mr. Beef Slab? I'm kind of sick of him. He's been in here for what feels like forever. I mean, I know in his storyline he's supposed to be like this invincible person, 
does that mean that they can't ban him because he's invincible? Because that's what it's starting to feel like a little bit. Let me know in the comments below what your opinions on that are. So, overall, I can understand why they banned all these things, and some of them I'm okay with it, other than I'm like, eh! But mostly I think it has to do with probably attendance was low for standards, because you're battling the same thing over and over. It gets kind of boring. But, um, yeah, let's... I'm I'm it, it, I, I I am pretty glad it's gonna stir things up a lot, and that means we're gonna get new decks, right? I'm all for a whole standard of new decks with new cards. It's gonna be great, and they're not all just gonna be Splinter Twin kitties, are they? Oh, I hope not. I hope not. Although I did open three Sahili Rise, so maybe maybe that this is this is good for me. But, oh yeah, that's right, I'm saving one of them, because when we get to 5,000 subs, I'm going to send that sucker out, and someone's going to be really happy, and maybe I'll have to find the, com the other half of the combo card, get that kitty, and send it with it. Let me know what you think of the ban announcements in the comments below. Um, like I said, I want this to be a discussion, because I'm not great on the modern ones, and I want to know what your opinions are on the standard ones as well. So leave that in the comments below, like this video, and subscribe for more.